Hi guys, it's me Stace. I am back again today with another Cricut Explore video and today we are doing our Make It Now Monday project and the one we're making today is actually for the little ones for the kids table come Thanksgiving. These are little, you know, you can use them for play settings. They're little crayon pockets. On the inside is a piece of paper that says I'm thankful for so they can write down what they're thankful for that year. Each one will hold up to eight crayons and you can personalize them with their name. You can make them double sided. Any image you want on the outside. I just chose pumpkins. But they're really cute and super easy. Let's go ahead and go to the computer and we will get started. Alrighty, at the computer you want to go to Cricut.com slash design. You're going to see this screen here. Upper left hand corner where this account. Click on that to sign in. Then enter in your email and your password. And then when you see your name in that green box, that verifies you were logged in. You want to go to the right, click on all categories. And then go down to Kid Crafts. It's the second one. It's called the Thanksgiving Kids Table Crayon Holder. Click on that. It'll bring up the preview window. And you'll notice down here where the project resources are. It's going to ask you to pay $0.99 cents for that turkey image. We're going to get to remove that replace it with a free one so we're able to cut this out for free. Bottom right, click on Customize. And then you'll see we have the holder and the piece behind it. We're going to right-click on it, hit Ungroup. Move that one over there and that one over there. Left hand side toolbar, insert images. I'm going to type in pumpkin, but you can use any image you'd like. And then just scroll down and find one that you like. And I'm going to choose this one here, and he is from Simply Scarecrows. Insert the image. On this piece, I want to right click on it, hit detach, and then remove that turkey. Hit the X. On this piece, where the little pumpkin guy, go to your layer panel. You'll see where the pumpkin is because it'll be highlighted. Click on each one and change each image to be right. Okay, so now we have our pumpkin there. I'm going to right click on him, move to front, put him on our little holder. I'm going to unlock it so I can make it a little bit bigger. Now, if you want to, here is where you can add the kid's name so you can make it personalized for each child, or you can make a double sided, do like a pumpkin on this side maybe a turkey on that one, all kinds of things you can do with it. Let me make it a little bit bigger. Take my left mouse button, drag it across the pumpkin and the holder, right click, hit attach. Go ahead and click on go. And we'll see our list part there and the holder. I'm going to go ahead and cut these out. We'll go to the table and put it together. Alrighty guys, everything went and cut out. I'm going to go ahead and crease on the score marks. First finger press and then go in there with your bone folder and give them a good crease. Like I said, you can certainly make them double-sided where they have an image on both sides to color in. You could also use these for Christmas time. I'm going to take my score tape. Put some on the bottom there. And then here. And they go together so easy. I think they'd be really cute with the child's name on them. Right, take the backing off the score paper. Fold them up. How easy was that, right? All right, now just take some crayons, and like I said, each one will hold up to eight. Put them in there, kind of wiggle them. Okay, and then just take your little place card. And put that in there. How cute, right? And super easy and super simple. I love that you can keep this part once they're done you know, writing down what they're thankful for. You can do the name and date and keep it as a keepsake and then bring it out the following year. And, you know, make it like a little tradition. I think oftentimes the kids' table gets overlooked at Thanksgiving. You know, usually the adults' table is all decked out. This time you can do it for the little ones. Really, really fun. Right, so there you guys have it. Today's Make It Now project. Any questions at all, please let me know. As always, thanks so much for watching. Have a great day and I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.